so I like to start my day off with a cup of celery juice and this is something that I've been doing but I'm also going to have green tea so I'm just gonna have this first on an empty stomach because I just gotta continue doing it we're on to my breakfast so I have the three eggs boiled eggs and my green tea I just finished my celery juice so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and eat this up and then I guess I'll have, no, I won't have another meal until my lunch, of course, so yeah. Yeah, so this is my lunch. I'm gonna have another celery juice because I feel really hungry. I have eggs, apple, and green tea. Lunch. All right, guys, so this is my lunch. Oh no, my dinner, my dinner. So I'm having a cup of oatmeal and a cup of green tea. I was gonna add fruits and stuff, but I feel like that's just adding unnecessary calories, so I'm gonna just avoid it. So yeah, this is dinner. Hey guys, so I'm in my bonnet and it's nighttime and I look crusty and dusty, but I'm gonna be showing you guys like my stomach before at the end of each day. Hold on, I Yeah, so I'm gonna be showing you guys my stomach at the end of each day. Um, I'm not gonna show you guys what I've been eating every day and I'm not gonna show like my weight every day because it's gonna fluctuate, so um, I showed you guys my starting weight, and I will show you my my. I'll show you the end result of my weight um, on the tenth day, of course, and yeah. So this is my stomach on day one. Hey guys so let me get away from sound so i'm on day six of the diet i've been doing it as i should every single day let me also show you my stomach in the bathroom because um i know i need to show you guys every day so this is day six now currently you know we're going through the whole corona thing I don't think I'm gonna be able to finish this diet. I went to the store, I can't find eggs anywhere. I thought I would have enough, but apparently I don't. So it looks like I'm gonna have to just end this diet here at day six. So I'm just gonna end the video here and you know, I'll just give you guys the, my summary of all these days and what I weigh now and everything. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to be um, basically breaking down this entire egg diet experience and I'm kind of like on vacation low key, even though like I'm not on vacation, but I am on vacation. It's weird. Um, I'm currently out of town, so I have to just film this video really quick, but I did the diet instead of doing it for 10 days, I did it for six days. And the reason being is because I can't find eggs anywhere because of this whole Corona mess. Um, and so I had to end it early because the next morning I didn't have my breakfast and I didn't want to substitute it for something and not do the diet the way it should have been. So, yeah. So six days of the diet, let's just say this diet was hard. For someone who constantly is eating out or eating just foods in general, it's, it's really hard to go from eating the way you want to eating just basically like nothing. Like it's a 900 calorie diet, so you're gonna feel it. Um, I did lose weight. I lost about 12 pounds. So 12 pounds in six days is not that bad. I'm not even gonna lie to you. That's pretty good. <laughs> so I was happy to know that I like, I lost that amount of weight, but, and I kind of really wanted to see what my goal would have, not what my goal, but what my weight would have been had I continued the diet. But since I didn't, 
I guess we'll never know because <laughs> I'm never going to do it again. Um, but yeah, the, the diet in itself um, wasn't difficult. It's just, you know, an egg, three eggs in the morning, three eggs in the afternoon with an apple, and then uh, oatmeal at night and green tea with each meal, which isn't like crazy hard, but I will never look at boiled eggs the same ever again. <laughs> I'm just speaking straight facts. Um, pros and cons. Pros is the weight loss. Pros is that you're not overeating constantly. But the cons is you're going to be super hungry the moment you stop this diet. And secondly, it's just not filling. Like, I feel like for someone who has a normal stomach, it might be filling. But for someone like me who wants to eat 24-7, it wasn't that great. So I wouldn't recommend this diet 1,000%. But if you have tried it or are attempting to try it, I'm not gonna steer you away from it because everyone's experience is different. I just am a big fatty and I love to eat and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna have to learn how to eat but also be healthy and work out and do all of those great things. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.